Hello. Hello, everyone. So, someone is watching us. Oh, hello, everyone. Hello, the festival of Docu Days. That is the morning workout together with the Veterano Brownie. So, here we are today and we'll be together with you and some do some cooking as the friends and the partners of the festival. We will be cooking the brownie out of our brownie mix. This is the set for cooking of brownie, in fact. Roman? And it seems those people really look like someone. Yes, the... That was the advertisement of antiseptic, so we really hope that all of you are staying at home now and you have totally self-isolated and you have enough time to watch all of the movies of DocuDays. Finally, this is the year when you can watch everything. So we have watched with Roman so far two or three, three Aurora. Uh, the Earth is Blue as an Orange of Irina Tsilik, and yesterday I decided to rewatch uh, The Northern Traveler, a wonderful film. Oh, we don't see you because you're too tall. So, look. The first and the most important. There will be prizes. Everything will be just... It will be a giveaway of brownie, which we're cooking now, and we will give it as a gift for the share. You need to share this broadcast into your page, and after our air, we will randomly choose the happy guy or lady, who, and we'll bring this brownie to him or her. And then, in the comments, you can write down the comments, and we will see them. Well, we will be sent the comments, yes, and the um, uh, questions. So if you write in the comments the funniest question ever, we will give you the gift of this mix. And also I have this kind of a fashionable hat. That's the steam fashion. So let us begin. Let us begin with really thoroughly washing hands. It's incredibly important. It's the proper way to do that. Please wash your hands. It's one of the recommendations of the WHO, World Health Organization, how to make you safe from coronavirus and be healthy, stay healthy. Now Ramon will wash up and I will do the same. As you can see, we have the proper aprons, which are cellophane aprons. So what can we speak or say tell about that? I could tell that under this cellophane apron I've got the merchant uh, goods of the festival. So you can purchase this perfect white t-shirt or the backpack and all the money which will be gained will be sent to support the festival which this year is online for the first time ever. And it's really a challenge and the, well, the challenge is the same, well, in fact, in Ukrainian and in English. So, I've worked uh, instead of the interpreter, because now you can hear the interpretation in YouTube, uh, and the original language is in Facebook and the website. So, in fact, from the very beginning, since the very beginning of the quarantine, the lockdown, the smell of the disinfector or antiseptic is the most popular smell at our place, at our home. So those are the kind of new measures, novelties, which we had to do. The so we should say measures, which is totally proper term. So, we should do the same with the gloves. We do the same procedure as we used to do with the hands. So, we begin the unpacking. Today we are cooking the classic brownie, because it's with me on the picture and because it's more expensive. But we have extra with Roman on the picture. Well, extra is with cacao cocoa. In the mix, within it, and inside, you can find this kind of a package, which is with the inside, when, that mostly, when you cook, you took out, 
you can take out to taste something, right? Well, you can try to make a joke. Uh, this package does not include the mix itself. So you have there a snack there, because anyway, when you unpack, you'd like to taste something. This is a little snack to taste. Then you have another package like this one. So in fact, brownie mix is the set of dry ingredients for our culture. There is one more like this. And we've got the most important part, the secret of the firm. In fact, the recipe and the secrets, which we tried out on, on six tons of brownies. More than six, right? Roman is calculating much better than I do. Well, I'm just calculating in an instant. I'm doing that right now live. 6,000, the first uh, brownie is now. We'll try whether those segments finally work after 6,000. So, let us begin the first stage to cook the brownie. Brownie is the super chocolate desert, and that's its difference from the cake. From any cake. Do I need to taste your headset? No, it's much better to hear you there. So, it has a big content of chocolate. It's Belgian chocolate mostly. And as for brownie mixes, it is within it. And the first way of cooking brownie is to mix the chocolate with the butter. And that's what we'll do. The butter is 200 grams a package, just a usual any butter of any brand, which you can buy in any supermarket. There's nothing unusual in that. So, to make it melt and uh, uh, quicker, you can just cut it in pieces. Or you can take it in a different shapes, like... So, we cut the butter. And uh, there will be the chocolate melting on, on our induction stove. So, now, induction stove is not compulsory to cook, to create, and to bake the brownie. Yes, you can do that using the gas stove as well. It's not the problem. So, when you take the chocolate and the butter, you need to create the a water layer, which is a very simple. You can just pour some water into a saucepan, and then you put another saucepan onto this water where the chocolate is melt. So here you take the package number one, and you can take, in fact, the secrets and do something, because I will be the one who perce uh, perceives. Ten steps towards your veteran brownie. You cut the... Um, uh, the butter, and then you melt it to have it... Uh, so this is the native advertisement, you know, that's what he's doing. The gluing of the logotype onto the forehead, because we brand this challenge and we're using any opportunity for the promotion. So... So this is the chocolate. You see it? So, it should be just enough to have one kilo. So, we're cooking, we're baking the whole chocolate, the full chocolate kilo. I do apologize for such a weird uh, camera work. It's really... We are ashamed to do that for the Documentary Film Festival. But I'm doing that with the help of my laptop. So, don't tense yourself. So, now nothing is happening at all. So, you can tell some story. Meanwhile, I can tell the story about the mixes, which happened once. So, should I do like that? Yes. So, we show this kind of a device, which is branded Bosch. It was the first mix. It was our first investment when we created Veterana Brownie to buy this device. The story of Veterana Brownie began in the beginning of March 2017 when we decided 
to implement this idea, just before the 8th of March, I bought this Bosch device. So it was on the 6th or the 7th of March. It was a kind of a gift for the Women's Day. Good for you, you creating the gift for your girlfriend or your wife for the woman of your dreams. This is the gift for the 8th of March. They don't hear you. So where's the mic? So you could take off the mask and then you can tell it. What, what will people say after that? So, I was just driving and I wanted to get up and to... Uh, I was in the tram and I wanted to tell myself. Yule didn't even know where to turn it on. This device, but still I wanted to say that this is the main story. The main story that yesterday, unfortunately, it perished. So just before the air, it died. So it doesn't work anymore. It was functioning for more than three years and we created more than three tons of brownie. And now it is sent to some other show. We have the first question here. The first question is, how much of chocolate? Well, the much you, as much as you need for the chocolate brownie. Is it substantial answer? Yeah, I've got it. I, I think it's enough. Unbranding. Okay. So is it peeling on my forehead? Well, yeah, epilation, I guess, on your forehead. So, unfortunately, it's not working today. But recently, I've bought this kind of device. And this will be the story that very often we were asked. If at home I don't have any special cooking devices, this is under the conditions of real field conditions, we will try to cook the brownie mixes. That is, I got rid of my main, main thing I've got, and this is the first time live online when you can see when I'm using in the air of the International Documentary Festival of Human Rights, I will cook the brownie, bake the brownie with this device. This is a very simple mixer. I think that it could be in any economic entity anywhere. I can't imagine a person who doesn't have a proper mixer. Maybe that's me. So should we mix the chocolate? Okay. Could you give me could you give me the headset? Yes, take it. So this is the melting process of the chocolate with the butter, but while it's melting, you can have some time to watch the movie from Doku Shorts a program because this year the Doku Days Festival is taking place at the Doku Space Platform for the first time ever. So to watch movies for sure and totally uh, and for free and legally, you need to register only. So while the chocolate is melting, you can do the same. You can just register and choose the film. For instance, Jean-Luc Godard has a very short movie of two minutes, so you can watch it. This is the mass, which is formed here. You should mix while you have the proper... You have to mix it properly to have it equally mixed. Yes, you should mix it till it's equally mixed. How many people are watching us? I can't tell you how many people are watching us. Maybe someone will write it in the comments in Facebook, but honestly, I don't see the number of people. I think that the most devoted fans or the most important fans are watching us. You know, those who are trying to catch the prizes. They want, okay, now we can get the kilo of brownie. So look, we are asked, this question number two in the studio. I'm just feeling 
that is just the craziness of the speed. So you you won't tell the ingredients and the proportions. Well, dear friends, a this is a commercial secret about the proportions. But as for ingredients, nothing is very complicated because they're written down on the package on the label. This is dark chocolate. 54.5% of cocoa product, then sugar, then flour, cocoa powder, vanilla sugar, and salt. That is it. That's very simple. Besides that, for the brownie, you will need the pack of butter. We do recommend to have at least 72% of grease of butter and five eggs, and voila! So, one online workshop from us for it to work totally at yours. So now, we'll have some magic going on, because the main, one of the most important. Now we'll have some magic going on, because one of the most important secrets my shrink and practically the Toronto Brownie, which was almost closed in summer 2017. So this was the firm secret that, that this mass should be totally have the consistency of the toothpaste. So it should stay at this and thicken until it looks like a toothpaste. Well, of course, it will take a bit of time, but Yulia as an experienced manager, will create some editing. This is the cut, and cut to a pause. You know how it's done in the TV. When different cook shows are shown, hop, and this is the frozen, the thickened mess. It's ready already. Perfect. It's very dense, this paste, and it's a bit even too overcooled. But it's okay. All of that is happening, in fact, real time. It was in winter last time. Not everything worked. We'll see how it works now. Whether I lost... How is it named? My... <laughs> my scales. Well, sometimes Roman likes such words. There's some jokes about Russian language. So could I take the mic? And we're beginning the second stage. So we're beginning the second stage. We have the third question. Goddamn, we have four questions. Wow. That is impressing. We had to make the whole table here with the title, like all of the popular bloggers have. That was a bad joke. The jokes about domestic violence shouldn't be there. They can lead to the end of bloggers' epoch. We do hope. So, we are asked whether the dogs can taste some brownie. Yes, sure. And how can we get not fatter? So, we have the question. FAQ. So, you say? How people mostly take and eat and devour deserts? You, s you feel stress, stress and stress, the informational space and noise during the day, lots of stress, and you think, I will have some sweets in the evening, and then you go to bed. But the idea is for you to come in the morning to have some desert, and then there will be stress, and then all of the grease, all of the fat will be burnt. So now look, we begin the second stage. We need five eggs. We need five eggs. Okay. So this is where our device should have been working, but it doesn't work, unfortunately, anymore. So we re recommend to take bigger eggs. C0 category of the egg. I don't know how it happens now. We'll try to make it. So. Okay. 
So we try to mix the eggs to have the consistency of the not-too-fat sour cream, to have this yellow foam in the end. So it's much better to begin from this side and to shoot it here. So this is the foam. Do you see this? Yes, the yellow one. So in the confectionery, there are several stages of mixing the eggs, as far as I got to know. But... Well, this is not my invention to have the yellow foam. This is the confectioner's uh, terminology to mix the eggs while till we have the yellow foam. Because there can be white one or it can be on your walls. Okay. Now we take our second package. Yes, the second one. Oh, we have the order coming. Mix classics. We do apologize, uh, all of those who are trying to order brownies at the websites, but the manager is me. So we will answer and uh, we'll make your order sure after the air. So in the package number two, we have the set of the dry ingredients we've mentioned. Then we add them. We have 15 minutes left, 15 minutes, so we'll have enough time for that. We add them into the mass. And try to mix it again. Well, or it, to have the perfect situation, ideally, we should have the special mixer for that, uh, uh, but additionally, we have to do that with our bare hands. Well, not bare, but with our hands. But for that, we should have the chaplet, the special chaplet, or wire whisk. So this is how we say this is already the consistency of the sour cream, which is not fat. And now we're coming closer to the final stage. I'm reminding you that if you ask us a funny question, the funniest question will get the gift of the brownie mix. Yes, the funniest. The funniest person, whether he's male or she's female, and... Besides that, if you share this broadcast among all, all of you, we will choose, we'll randomly choose for whom we will give this gift of a brownie we're cooking and baking now. So I'm asked, oh my god, we've got so many questions, we've got two, three more questions, Roman. So, do you have enough time to watch the festival films? Have you seen anything? Could you share the impressions? Well, the part, some part of the films in the program of DocuDays this year have been seen by me in uh, Idva, that is the festival in Amsterdam, but I loved them so much that I'm watching them for the second time. You can watch them at night. This is the life hack. You're in the night time. In Amsterdam, I didn't have enough time to come to the night, uh, the Midnight Traveler, which I mentioned above. This is a really, really beautiful and live movie, lively movie, which is done by the Afghani director and his wife. 
the story is that the first film of this film director was about one commander of Taliban, and after that, there was appointed the prize for his head, so they had, they had to escape. So The Midnight Traveler is the film about their travel, about their journey, as it's mentioned in the beginning of the film, to the edge of the hell. This is a very intimate, lively view onto the story about how you have to run to escape from your own home. It's not a classic one as lots of other movies about the migrants, about the topic of uh, refugees. I would really advise you. I think that it was uh, only 150 views left before we began this air, so just rush to DocuSpace and watch this movie. It's a very fair, honest one, and it's uh, taken only three cell phones to shoot it. So this is the, uh, the point when the sense is much more interesting and full of volume than the shape. Also, we watched Aurora, but unfortunately the views are out there, so you can find Aurora somewhere at a different platform or different festival. This movie should be found because it's about the Aurora, the singer, which is a very typical plot when you are becoming famous in a very quick way and you need to choose between the art, commercial part, yourself and the art, and it's a very beautiful film. And the earth is blue as an orange. I think that after the lockdown, the quarantine, and after the festival year of Irina Tsilik, this movie will be shown on bigger screens or will be able to watch it at Techflix, for, for instance, the online platform, which is really cool. And one more question, and we'll get better, closer to the finals. There is the question, can we create the brownie, can we bake the brownie without an oven? An oven. I think that there, is, there are some recipes, but not with our brownie mix. We need to have an oven for that. That is why just purchase, you should acquire the oven, and then the brownie mix. Then we are asked whether can we take uh, and eat brownie without the stress if we just dream is brownie and stress are always going hand to hand no of course it's not always like that it was just a joke how not to get fat uh, you see it was not even the joke you see we have the teamwork here we have the proper understanding of each other and my yeah the gloves are torn now so we are asked if you bake the brownie with your beloved one is it more delicious than if i do it on my own when of course when you cook for yourself i honestly i don't rem i don't remember when i was just cooking or baking for myself it's really cool because you invest not that much you don't spend too much of time when you want to surprise someone for instance, to your under, to your consider, for your consideration. So now we are transforming into the Italian culinary show. Now we'll have some plates flying. So the final stage. So this mass, in fact, this something. So, would you tell why we don't have that many pictures from the kitchen or user-generated content? Why don't we have uh, some brownies which are not that beautiful? Well, we are creating brown cookies, so visually this process is not that beautiful. Because, just because of the brown color of the chocolate. All of the jokes should be mentioned in the comments, you can make jokes about that. And also we have the brownie with white chocolate, we name it Blondie, and it of course has a more pleasant view during the baking and cooking. And this is our device where we cook it into the oven. Of course you don't have, uh, need such a bigger one, because any just everyday oven will be working. 
well, so far, we'll try to see whether the lockdown is too long. Maybe after that, we'll begin to sell the bigger ovens, because life can be a real mess. We'll see. We had one more task. Sure, but I need to show it. Yes, this is the process. So we mix all of that, we stir it very thoroughly till we have the consistency of what? We feel it's equal. We could have done it with a mixer, the Bosch mixer, or the kitchen unit. Uh, but as you know from the previous episode, it perished, so it's not working anymore. That is why now we do that with our hands. Well, I say we, but Roman is doing everything. So it's smooth now. Roman said that this is the life. That was schizoid life. Okay. We're going on with that. So it, it's in the end, this is as the best as we can. As they say, when you if you took the Bosch into your hands, just bake the brownie. Okay. And now we will pour all of this mess into the special form. Our brownie square. It's a perfect shape, and the brownie, the perfect brownie should be the square one, but you can use any one, the rectangular one, the round one. So the first brownie which Roman cooked for me and baked for me was round brownie, so it was not true brownie, but it was really delicious. It was the beginning. So first one brownie and then six tons of brownies. Very soon we'll sell those forms for you to work it to work it on and to make it the most delicious ever here it is the perfect shot the perfect frame I'm just a support team. Okay, there's a question. How can I explain to my vegan friend uh, that I won't die if I cook this delicious thing? No, you cannot explain that to vegans. He's not a friend to us anymore. Well, you can make friends with us after that, you know? It really, we really would like to create the taste without the eggs. And with the pre-order, we can create the lactose-free or gluten-free brownie. And I know that somehow there will be a moment in our history when we'll create the vegan brownie, and it will be as delicious as this one. But so far, make friends with us. So you need to make this beautiful way of flattening it. Well, so far it's not that beautiful, but it will be like that. It will be beautiful. You need to flatten it. Make it smooth. 
I used the moment that he just took some time of Euler's. So this is why we organized all of that. And the final part, we are sending our brownie into the oven. Seventy degrees of heat for thirty minutes. For half an hour with a temperature of one hundred and eighty degrees. One hundred and eighty. And I think that we had enough time of the air. We stick to the schedule. I've got some chocolate on my nose. This is perfect. This, how, this is how I imagined the process of cooking and baking. We've got nine minutes left to answer all of the questions. Nine minutes to wash the dishes? Wash the dishes, honestly. Well, in fact, the confectioner will come soon. And we need finally to make this space free because there will be the shift of our confectioners so we need to just escape from here because it's not our kitchen in fact what do you mean it's not ours well this kitchen is of our confectioners because they cook much more than we do here I made all of that with my own hands. Well, this is the story how Roman screwed it in and this mixer with his own hard-working hands and arms. So the kitchen is mine. Okay, the kitchen is ours, everything is ours. <laughs> the kitchen is ours. So how can we... How could, do we uh, make the brownie out of a zebra? You go to the Africa, you take the zebra, you create the ingredients and they put zebra into the brownie. Well, it won't be vegan for sure, but still it will be a zebra brownie. A very niche question. How do we make a honey brownie? Please, listen to me. The honey brownie shouldn't be baked. You should do either honey cake or brownie. That is why, under the conditions of the confectionery, you need to do something really cool, something separate thing. If you do movies, please do movies. The honey cake shouldn't be the brownie. I've got an adolescent uh, son, so do you need any helpers? Because he knows how to cook domestic brownies. Well, we... We don't take the underaged, but thank you for the offer. Maybe you can take his time using our mix or lots of uh, some pile of YouTube broadcasts how they cook brownies. But in fact, those brownies won't be as sweet as ours. This is the only thing we can advise you how to overcome this isolation conditions with your kids. Give them more time and opportunity to cook together with you. Are you the expert in that? In fact, I don't have the title that I'm a child expert. I'm just answering while you are washing up, washing the dishes. And we could do it vice versa. You could wash the dishes. No, we couldn't. So this was our brownie mix. I think that we will say goodbye to you now. It was super thank you to everyone who stayed with us on air. This is our first experience, and I do hope that you loved it. Well, because when it was uh, the show of Voice of Ukraine, uh, the, he didn't reach the stage of live air. That is why his live air is now. I won't ask him to sing now. Could you come up to me, please, now? Yes. So we'll say goodbye to you now. All of you are so cool, so in any one of you has been cooking brownie together with us simultaneously, I still have chocolate on my nose. I think that they are on the stage of thickening of the chocolate mess. So give us the picture, what's the result of your cooking? You can tag us, Veterano Brownie, in Facebook and Instagram, come as guests uh, after the lockdown, and the most important thing, watch the movies, docuspace.org. O-R-G, and don't pirate, donate.
We remembered. We've learned by heart this super slogan. It should be safe and legal at the platform of DocuSpace There are approximately 55 films which are still accessible at the platform, so you have some time up till 10th of May to watch them. The Ukrainian program can be watched 24 hours after the first night, so today up till 6 p.m. you have the time to watch Zarvanitsya, and after that it will be the uh, another first night, so we do invite you to watch it. The film which I heard since I was the student in if Mohilar, a journalistic school. And thanks to them and Katya Hornostai. Hello, Katya. This is how I created my first film with my first night at DocuDays. Roman creates a nice frame now. This is the brownie.